Hey everyone, Kevin with Aloft here with our latest update to air control. There are a few major changes we'd like to highlight in this release. First, air control is now more mission centric. With our missions now available from the dashboard, we can now see our missions that have been approved, assigned to us and past their start time. From this screen, we can also filter our missions for better visibility in case we need to revisit a mission or perhaps we've closed one by accident. Lastly, we can also create missions, if permissions allow, from this screen just like before. The next major change involves automated flights, since missions has now replaced that section. Automated flights can be found within your in-flight map, so once you select fly or your mission and proceed through your workflow, you'll be able to select the in-flight map and choose the appropriate flight to load before powering your aircraft on. The automated flight should display right on the in-flight map. And once we connect and load this automated flight, we'll also have a new HUD component with the flight, the name, and the duration, along with our start and stop buttons. That about covers everything for today. Please keep a lookout for future updates and snippets like this. And as always, thank you for choosing Aloft and fly safe.